Hello, Libra. This is a bonus reading for you for August 2019, the end of August 2019. The energy is coming in for Libra, hopefully positive energies for Libra. Energy is coming in for Libra, end of August 2019, five card spread. See what the beginning energy is, and then we'll do the five card spread. Remember, this will not resonate with all Libras. So we got here. Ace of Cups, you're not willing to make a new emotional offer with somebody or someone's not willing to make it with you or um, you're attempting to, but something is getting in the way. So we got to figure out what's going on. Past position, you had something that you thought or you were going for something you thought was going to bring you overall stability with the Ten of Pentacles. Some of you may have, you know, done very well on your job, maybe got a promotion, maybe some money came in, or like I said, stability. You, you were wanting this or you got it. Ten of Pentacles. Obstacle. The, the Hermit in Reverse. Maybe it's telling you you got to come out of Hermit mode, huh? Maybe you got to start um, getting out there more, expressing yourself more. Maybe some of you are feeling down. Current environment for the end of August, the Two of Swords. You're wanting peace. You're wanting a peace of mind. And you may put things away from you or refuse to see things because they're, they're disturbing you. You know, that could be why you're the hermit for some of you. Or maybe you're dealing with a hermit person. Outside influences or what is coming towards you, becoming unchained from a um, situation where you feel you can't get out from or that you were always bound to before. And it could be with, you know, the outside environment, becoming unchained. Maybe you need to become unchained from something. And I will clarify these. As you know, when I clarify, it changes the story up. Outcome, you're not making a decision. You, that's, what, uh, that's what the problem is. You need to make a decision. You're uh, unable to let go of something possibly with the two of wands in reverse. And I will clarify these and see what's going on. Now in the past, you got the Ten of Pentacles. And I told you what that was. Oh, you were able to manifest something. Something upset you. And that's what we got to figure out. So we got the Ten of Pentacles, the Magician. Man, these cards are trying to pop out. King of Wands, trying to manifest something, a stability with the King of Wands. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, possibly. You know I do not assign one Zodiac sign to a court card when you read for the masses. It's just ridiculous to even try. So we go for the energies. And the King of Wands, it could be a fire sign or someone with a fiery temper, quick temper, or um, not feeling well, or... I don't know. Maybe they don't feel very secure. Maybe they lost some of their passion. And, or you lost some of your passion with them. And you're trying to manifest that in the past. For some of you, you may be dealing with a, even an older type um, fire sign. Let me get another card for that since those two fell out. So we got the Ten of Pentacles. The Magician able to manifest something with the King of Wands. It's in reverse. Or trying to. Why are you there? For Libra. What's going on? There's that devil again. Someone is um, stuck on something, chained to a person, and, you know, in the mental sense, feeling like they can't break free, feeling like um, they really need to be around them in some ways with the devil. For others, they're trying to break free from something, but they feel like they can't. And like I said, for others, you're trying to manifest the situation, maybe get together with some, someone, and maybe... Um, for some of you, even me, use magic. I see that here. Someone's trying to use something to get somebody, possibly. But be careful of that. Now, the obstacle is the hermit in reverse. And the hermit in reverse, as the obstacle could, could be that, oh, I got to have another card. Because it could be either trying to come out of hermit mood or staying in it. So the hermit in reverse, why are you there? For Libra as the obstacle. What is going on? Yeah, you feel like you didn't gain a victory with something. i got to pull these cards apart to drive me crazy. Um, you feel like you didn't get a victory in something and you're pondering upon it. You know, you're trying to figure out how to gain a victory. The Hermit in reverse, the uh, Six of Wands in reverse as the obstacle. 
This is what you have to overcome, by the way. Why are you there for Libra? Page of Pentacles, you're not receiving messages of stability with someone, or maybe you're wanting these messages to come in. Maybe you're thinking too much. Maybe you're thinking about sending a message, but you're unsure. Now, the time being, that's what I'm thinking now with the Two of Swords. You're unsure. You don't see things clearly, and you want peace in your life. That's about having peace and not letting the negatives in. And sometimes you got to put your swords up just so you get through the day, you know, um, to get through something. So the Two of Swords as the current environment for latter part of August. Why are you there for Libra? Why are you there? Yeah, you're wanting some independence. You're wanting some gain in your life. And to do that, you're feeling like you got to um, not see the negatives. you got to put your swords up, like I said. So the Two of Swords in the upright. Nine of Pentacles in the upright. Good cards. So you're, you're trying to go for your gain and your independence. Why are you there? And you're trying to come out of disappointment with something with the Five of Cups in reverse. You really are. And I see that. For some of you, I'm thinking you try to manifest something that was kind of toxic in the past and you were trying to get it to work. Something that maybe had worked at one time and then something went amiss. Maybe the King of Wands kind of got all messed up somehow or something messed up with them. But let's find out what the outside environment, the devil, the devil is in reverse as the outside environment of what is coming towards you. The devil in reverse, why are you there for Libra as the outside environment? Why are you there? The moon. Mm. Something comes out possibly by someone you know. Could be a Capricorn, doesn't have to be. It could be something comes out with someone you were chained to at one time, you know, in the mental sense, physical sense sometimes. Or someone's not telling you something. Could be that too. The moon could be either or. But I'm thinking it's more hidden things, but it's someone's becoming unchained from a secret, a situation. I'm trying to figure out what it is. I need another card. The devil in reverse, the moon in the upright. Why are you there for Libra? What's going on? have to do with the king of pentacles but this could be as someone's trying to regain stability and they're trying to become unchained with you or you're trying to un become unchained from them and someone's not telling somebody 100 percent what they're doing to try to regain the stability because i see the nine of pentacles there is someone trying to regain their you know regain uh finances and independence and get by in life and come out of disappointment as an outside environment, someone's holding back on you a little or you're holding back on somebody and trying to loosen the bonds you had with them in some way. But you're still keeping to yourself, thinking too much. And it's like you're expecting a message, but you're afraid to hear messages sometimes because you've got a blindfold on currently. You're thinking, I don't know if I can handle the messages. That could be it too. So you're going for something that you feel is better for you in some way that's going to bring you more money because you're so disappointed you just can't deal with it you got to throw your yourself into being busy now in the end you got the two of wands in reverse oops seven of cups this is someone not deciding on something right now and i figured that i mean you're going for your gain and things of that nature but you're not going to make a an important decision about certain options that may come to you. You may say, I need to put this off for now. At least at the end of August, you're saying this, this decision. Someone may require a decision from you, but you're like, I'm not ready to make this one yet. So two of wands in reverse, seven of cups in reverse. While you're there is a final outcome. I think you need to separate yourself just for a little while and think about it. But the obstacle is maybe you'd be thinking about it too long, you know? So the two of wands in reverse, seven of cups in reverse, why are you there? For Libra at the very end, of the final outcome for the end of August. So you're indecisive in a way. Yeah, you're not, you're not gonna talk about it just yet. You're not ready. 
you're not ready to talk about it or someone's not ready to talk about it with you, you say, I need some time out. I need some peace to get myself together and come out of this disappointment, whatever you were in with somebody. It doesn't show any, I don't see any final, like I don't see a divorce or a uh, total cutoff because I don't see the death card and the only tens I see is in the past and you were happy at one time, content or trying to go for your contentment. You're trying to manifest, but at the same time, you're stuck in your head about something a little bit and you're saying, I need to put this away from me right now. I can't deal with it until I get myself together. And that's what it is for Libras at the end of August. And this is just for the end of August. So if it resonates, you know, just go with the flow and September will soon be here. And then you're going to possibly deal with it. If I can remember in your um, September spread, because this is just a bonus for August. In the very end, you will come out of hangman mode or you just don't like being stuck with the hangman. It's also indecision. Someone possibly trying to talk or do something but they're unable to like they it's like you know what's going on but you're unable to um move just now but you plan to you know make a move you plan on make a decision just not right now because that you're just too unhappy in your home and you're trying to come unstuck with the eight of swords in reverse because you feel like you didn't get, you know, your overall contentment with this situation. You feel like your intuition is off or you may make the wrong decisions if you react now or at the end of August. But you will react in September. So look at September's reading. And I will upload this as soon as I can. I'll talk to you later. Bye.